What's up, J-Team? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I'm Trinity. Today, I have some more new TikTok hacks for y'all. Let's get this video to 10K likes, J-Team. I know y'all can do it. Y'all hit goals. Oh, and by the way, your girl has finally ooh, dropped some merch. Let me give y'all a close-up. J-Team, bold, brave, and beautiful. If you wanna pick up this merch, all you gotta do is click the link below. I made another shirt and hoodie that says, it looks good, but do it taste good. Does it look good, but do it taste good? So I guess you could say it look good, but do it taste good. It look good, but do it taste good. Because it look good, but do it taste good. It looks good, but do it taste good. And it look good, but we gotta find out if it tastes good. Good. Cause it look good. But do it taste good? We don't. We don't. We don't. This first hack is going to be a Chipotle hack. Apparently, there's another way to save money. Just when we thought that we knew every hack in the book at Chipotle, there's a new one. It's only gonna be about like $5, and you're basically building your own nacho, which is crazy. Why doesn't Chipotle have like a nacho on their menu? They have a burrito, taco, burrito bowl, salad bowl. Yet y'all don't have no nachos. But they don't need nachos. We have figured out a way to make our own nachos at Chipotle. Let's head to Chipotle and let's see if this hack is really a hack. Cause it's not until you actually show up trying these hacks where it's confirmed that it's actually a hack and you're saving money. It is time to head to Chipotle. Oh man, y'all it's hot today. It's like 102 in Texas. Before I take off, let's make sure we really know how to order this, okay? This girl gave very much detailed instructions. Okay, $5 nachos. So she orders a kid's meal in, in an empty burrito bowl. That's if you're gonna be eating in your car. And then she crunches up the top. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Especially before lunchtime hour, geez. It's probably gonna be packed up in there. So the total was actually like eight dollars and thirty something cents. So I'm not sure exactly where I went wrong. I said a kid's meal, and with that you get a meat and two sides. I got steak and I got tomato, well, salsa, tomato, whatever, and corn, which I don't know why I chose corn. Y'all know I don't really like corn. <laughs> I think I tried to do it just like the old girl's video. <laughs> it might taste good when it's all together. And I got a side of sour cream and queso. Did that run up a number? And it came with either an apple or a small chip. And then she wanted to know what I wanted to drink. And I'm like, oh, well, you know, a kid's milk or a kid's apple juice. I said an apple juice. Either way, let's get into it because your girl's hungry, okay? Sour cream, the queso, which I never really do, but hey, you know. Got the apple juice. The small chip, which I believe the girl also had in the video. And then we have the actual meal. She wanted to know if I wanted hard shells or soft, and I said hard because it's supposed to be nachos, right? Because we're gonna be crumbling that up. Now it's time to put this together. This is where the real hat comes in, and at the end of it, y'all can pretty much decide if it's giving or if it's not giving. And you know what? I'm actually gonna use this tray to kind of like build it, you know? First, you're gonna take your tacos and you're going to break them up. Yes, these are acting as chips. Like this. You know what? I'm trying not to try not to break them too small. <laughs> and then the small chip bag that they gave you, you're gonna add that. In my head, I'm just thinking, does this come like in its own thing? Like, can you ask for a kid sized chip bag? And then maybe a side of queso. Call it a good old little chip dip. I don't know. Let's take our corn, let's add on to our nachos. Actually, you could make it in this little uh, part right here if you wanted to. Put a little bit of tomato on now. Put the steak on there. It really does look good. 
but do it taste good go ahead and get your it looks good but do it taste good merch or you can get the JT merch you know the link would be below gonna add a little bit of corn I don't know why I chose corn like what was I thinking actually the interaction with this girl was a little off I will say and it was all me y'all it was all me story time I've never ordered any type of kids meal from Chipotle at all you know it was already awkward because you know how people are they'll be like but you're not a kid I didn't know if I was gonna get that vibe okay so I'm like um yes can I have a kids meal and she's like yeah and she says something else and I didn't know exactly what she said she said I felt like I heard her say kids or toddlers that's what I felt like I heard, kids or toddlers. She had a very soft voice. The thing about me is, if you have a very, let's just say that my hearing is not all the way there. Let's just keep it real. My hearing is probably not all the way perfect. So I said kids and she's like, quesadillas or tacos? I'm like, why didn't I hear that? Why didn't I hear, why didn't I hear quesadillas or tacos? Or tacos or quesadillas? Like, I had no clue, okay? I say tacos. And she's like, okay. So I tell her my sides and all this type of stuff. And then um, before she even gets to the checkout, you know, she's preparing it and then she says cash. And I'm like, oh no, card. And then she was like, oh no, somebody in the back's name is cash. Bruh. I'm like, oh, <laughs> like this is getting awkward y'all I haven't been outside in a minute I have not been on these streets you know after being uh, pregnant for nine months and just kind of trying to not get sick you know that's why I really stayed inside most of the time because I'm like look I can't afford to get sick COVID still out there lurking you know whatever it's hot outside you know I'm pregnant I can't afford to be up on these Texas streets I can't afford to get into an accident and all that type of stuff, even though a guy did hit my car while I was pregnant, literally about nine months, but okay, I survived. So I wouldn't put it past me that I might be a little like off to the world. But anyways, that's it. Ooh, my taco's looking so good. Let me give y'all a close up. Now y'all have to admit that this looks really, 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 really good. Y'all gotta admit this. This really looked like some straight up nachos, like Chipotle. Y'all don't have no nachos. Shoot, it really do look good, but do it taste good? We about to find out. Make sure to go get your It Looks Good But Do It Taste Good merch. The link is below. I didn't make a lot. So if you purchase one, not only will it be posted on the page, but you'll be very, very special. <laughs> It really might be limited edition for real, for real. Oh, I added my hot sauce. I'm gonna even crack open this uh, apple juice. I'm going all in. Comment below, what do you think about this Chipotle hack? Like, it's it looks like it's given to me. Dear Lord, please bless this food and let me nourishment to my body in Jesus' name. We pray, amen. Mmm. I didn't know the queso was that good. I'm gonna let y'all know now. I would reorder this because I like nachos more than quesadillas. I like nachos more than tacos. I love a good loaded nacho. I would say this is still pretty good as far as like what you're going to get out of it compared to what you're going to pay for. Even though I didn't pay $5 and something since like the girl in the video. I still don't know what I did wrong. I'm sure y'all going to tell me. Mm. So it's this new drink. Apparently it's new. The Simply Spiked. Okay. You know the brand that makes like the orange juice, the lemonade. Apparently they made a spiked one. Which is for the older people. 21 and up. If you are not 21 and up, don't drink. Don't do it. Don't do it. I am way over 21. As you're probably going to hear me say at least one more time in this video. I went hunting for this Simply Spiked lemonade okay and i will say it's like one of those things where some places are going to have them some places may not have them i really tried to make sure that i was going to go to a place that had them and it says that it's at kroger's also at target i'm going to try kroger's and hopefully they have it i've never been to kroger's before y'all as y'all know i'm from north carolina okay so some of these stores are kind of new i'm still trying to find like my favorite grocery store around here so far H-E-B has the cake okay but Kroger's might be cool hopefully they have it because 
that's the only why I'm going. If they don't have it, maybe I can call Target to see if they have them. Either way, let's try to see if we can go on the hunt for this spiked lemonade, y'all. Okay, so Kroger's did not have it, even though they claimed to have had it. They didn't have it. Let me make sure my door's locked. Your girl stay ready, okay? Can't get caught slipping out here. Target has also said that they had it. It's so crazy because I feel like I'm always like last to get something you know what i'm saying like everyone just runs and gets it at the same time i might just mess around and try the whiskey lemonade crown royal the packaging is so good y'all look and this has texture to it they just got money it's really really good it's very it's very like refreshing. I like this. <laughs> I like this. I just like how refreshing it is. Lemon is just very refreshing. So it doesn't feel like, ugh, alcohol, ugh. You know what I'm saying? It feels like, ooh, this is like refreshing. As if you literally just poured a little bit of something in some lemonade, some really good lemonade. And it has 7% of alcohol in it. I kind of have a sweet tooth, okay? I want to try this. It's kind of giving cookie crisp cereal. Basically chocolate chip cookies, mini chocolate chip cookies, and basically I'm gonna eat it like cereal. This is really some hungry, munchy, creative, but unnecessary type of thing. It look good, but do it taste good? We are gonna find out. I have some cookie dough, and this is the eat or bake, which is great. I think my daughter, you know, if she take a nap, I don't know if y'all been able to hear her from the back, but she ain't taking a nap. So she might not be getting no cookies. So basically with this, you don't want the cookies to be big. You want them to be small. So I'm gonna try to make them as small as possible. These already look pretty small. I bet some of y'all just wanna go ahead and eat this. Comment below, are you the type to eat cookie dough by itself? Like, are you the cookie dough ice cream lover growing up my sister she loved eating cookie dough so i'm gonna cut these in half and roll it i'm gonna be making them this small I'm just gonna i'm cutting them in half like this and now i'm gonna roll them and drop roll them and drop roll them and drop now i could have probably just left them cut up but i'm kind of going for the perfect shape I think this is enough to make a nice bowl. So now I'm gonna pop it in the oven and hopefully it turns out great. The cookies are done and they look really good. They look really, really good. Check them out. They do look very mini. They're giving cookie crisp. Now we just need to put them in a bowl with some milk. This is so crazy. I cannot believe I'm doing this. So now, time to pour in the milk of your choice. Oh my gosh, this is when it gets a little cringy. That was weird, but it, I'm still here for it. I'm actually really excited. I am. Let's go. Mmm. This is so good. They good to me. No words. No words need to be said. It's really, really good. It's really, really good. It is a little extra, but I'm extra, so I'm here for it. The thing is, I've never liked Cookie Crisp. Never liked it because I like chocolate chip cookies um, to be soft, you know what I'm saying? So if it's hard, if it's giving crunchy hard, it's not gonna work for me. This was just, it was so good. I really wanted the milk to be ice cream so bad, but it was good, it was good. That's all, I ain't got nothing to say. Nothing else to say. You saw it for yourself. It looked good. 
and it did taste good. I'm on the couch. That means I'm tapping out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it was pretty short, or at least it felt short. Not in real life though. It felt really long and really hot. Definitely click the link below. Just check out the merch. Like I said, it's only a few made. So if you just wanna be that one to just have the merch, then so be it. I would really appreciate it, of course. Big shout out to the J team. If you wanna shout out like them, all you gotta do is click subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and let me know below. And that's it. Make sure to be bold, brave, and beautiful. And I will talk to y'all in my next video. Bye.